Hello there and welcome to the new tutorial where I will show you the third part of doing the searching within Tableau. So, so far what I have shown you is two different searching techniques. One is uh, by specifying manually. Earlier, you know, if you specify something manually over here, uh, then it will going to search within the product name manually. Then we created the parameter and automated it. So right now the parameter is present that is present in the second video. So what I've posted earlier, the second video. So here, if I select any parameter, the value will be updated accordingly. Now the third thing which I want to show you is irrespective of where the value is either in the category or here or here, the value should be filtered or the entire table should be filtered accordingly. That means my parameter should be able to take the value anywhere that is present based on these multiple fields and should be able to filter it. Okay, so how we can do that? Well, to do that, what I need to do is I need to change my filter from list to all and maybe let's say the on is present over here. That's the first thing I need to do and then I need to go here in this calculated field which we created earlier. So now we have product name and if I just copy this and say all, paste it here and change the product name to category and or change the product name to subcategory. So what it will going to do this function or this formula will going to search everywhere category, subcategory or product name and will going to give us the output so if I click apply okay and now if I right now if you see wherever the h o n on is present the value is coming to you but let me just change it to dax so wherever the dax is present it is coming now let me change the to office so here office is present even the office supplies over here which is present it may be the case that office must be present in maybe these fields but what we're going to take care is wherever the office is present, it will going to give us the output. So that's the benefit of this. So maybe if I just say technology or tech. So wherever the technology is present, it will go into so tech is present here, tech is present here, tech is present here. Wherever it is present, it will going to give us the output and that's mainly I wanted to show you how you can further automate and search it across the multiple categories here to make your dashboard or make your report really dynamic where you can give the flexibility at, in the hand of the user and uh, and basically make them a powerful user where they can do whatever search they want to do related to the report or the dashboard that you have prepared. So that's about it and I'll meet you in the next topic.